Previously on the block. They were 39 days down and the game was taking its toll. Come on, you guys, teamwork. I just don't want to play anymore. They were battling with their tradesmen. Oh. These are fragile. Oh, God. What have they done? I come home and there's crap everywhere. Got a lot to do. And fighting against time. Why are you going to the pit? Because there's the nothing we can do about it. And they came face to face with their greatest oh. enemy yet, <laughs> the budget. We won't have a room to reveal on Sunday. Oh, my God. <laughs> Stephen doesn't trust me. When you've only got so much money and we've reached it. <laughs> Welcome to the block. Tonight on the block, it's room delivery time. Yeah! <laughs> Richard's gone, so I don't know what's going on. Oh my god! Sounds up. <laughs> I can't believe they did this. Just beware. Oh my god. What? They're playing the old game. What do you mean, what? There's just no end inside, is there? No, that's it. Just don't you move. No, 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 no. Just keep moving, honey. Righto, guys, time's up. I now declare the block open for inspection. Well done, guys. Hey, hey. Oh, 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 my God. Plastic flowers. I'm not sure that this style is particularly relevant to Manly. It's not even a bedroom. That's tacky. It's Friday morning and a little over 60 hours to go before our couples are due to deliver their next room, room number three. Jane was up for work early this morning and off to Melbourne on business, which means Matt will have to work especially hard this morning just to meet the deadline. Matt, get up, mate. Crash. How is this? <laughs> wakey, wakey. Good morning, mate. Hey, guys. How are you, mate? Oh, 10 to 7. They're early. There's just no end in sight, is there? <laughs> I do feel like I've been hit by a truck this morning. I'm exhausted. <laughs> Jason and Kirsten are delivering a media room this Sunday. If he can put the desk together, that is. I know. I might have three degrees, but I can't put together a freedom piece of furniture. Which is not freedom's fault, I'm sure, but a number of times I've attached things though and then realised I've attached them the wrong way. I love someone who's early. You gotta get up, mate. I know. Oh, please don't ask me to carry your material up with you. Okay. Alright, you, you bring it up, I'll be out there in about five seconds. You gotta count before you that up, mate. I don't know, Richard got up early to, because he had to take his car in for a service, and I don't know, <laughs> Richard's gone so I don't know what's going on. I've just got to, I don't know, wait and see. <laughs> I have no idea. Because Richard schedules everything to happen. I know what they've got to do, it's just I don't know who's coming, and when they're coming, and if they're coming, so. That was step three, honey. Good on you, darling. I've got step ten. I'm... <laughs> It's taken 45 minutes to do step three. As long as it's done by Sunday. Yeah, I guess that's right. <laughs> I've got one sock. And no shirt or belt. Andrew, it seems, is also having problems putting things together this morning. I'm not going to put my shoe on without a sock. Like his clothing. No, I don't want Upstairs, Steve and Richard are well underway with their home office, 
Unfortunately, they've lost what they thought was their secret edge. Our secret bomb was going to be that we had a home automation system and um, we found out somehow, I can't remember how, that um, another couple on the block is also doing a home automation system, in fact the same one that we're doing. Unfortunately, that sort of blows our exclusive home automation system. And we were a bit let down, but then at the end of the day we decided, well, to not have it would be at an even bigger disadvantage. If everything goes to plan today, the floor goes down, the kitchen goes in, the mirrors go on, the painting starts. Take a before shot, because at five o'clock tonight it should look different. So I've got one together, and I've learned a lot of lessons from this one. That's what was left over from the first lot, so I can only think that I might have missed one or two pieces, but that's all right. What's uh, about 15 screws and 20 nails? <laughs> <laughs> it's Friday the 13th. And all that Ardex equipment came to $666.60 on Friday the 13th. You are joking. No. So something's going to go wrong. A key element to this game is the auction. After all, that's the day our couples get to make their money. But to get to auction, these apartments have to not only be fully renovated, decorated and furnished, but they also have to comply with the Building Code of Australia. And it's our site foreman, Dave Harding, who's in charge of policing the code. Dave came up the other day, just when we'd had that, that step up into the dining area. Now, I was talking to um, some people about this step up, which is the crux of that whole kitchen design. It doesn't work without it. And he said, look, this isn't going to comply with the building code. You're going to have to pull the whole thing out. In the meantime, every trade's had to keep going through, and the finished floor's going down. And then the building surveyor sends us up a fax with the relevant clauses and stuff, which pretty much says, yes, I can understand how you made that judgment, but it's wrong, here's all the evidence to the contrary. Um, and uh, we just presented it to Dave who was sweating it up out there. <laughs> We've broken out in a sweat day. Sweating like the proverbial, mate. We should have From reading up. this. Yeah. Who would have thought we could adapt bathroom furniture so well? This was our um, splat, part of the splash range that we got $1,000 vouchers for we didn't want to use in the bathroom for a number of reasons. It looks fantastic. This is the part I don't like, mate. What's that? We're a path to the door is not a path of travel to an exit. Right, I'll go and read this properly, right? Yeah, yeah. Because I know there's a couple of traps in here that you guys are trying to set me up with. <laughs> We're not. We're just no, just I might be green, mate, but I'm not a cabbage, all right? <laughs> I suppose the absolute fallback position, which is one I don't really want to think about at this stage, is that to ramp in timber it down to, to the next level. If, if Dave comes back and says no, I'll, I'll challenge it. We'll go higher. We'll take it all the way to the top. It's Saturday morning, and while the rest of the country begin their unwind time after a hard week of work, our couples are doing the opposite. After a hard week of work and renovating, they're getting all wound up over the smallest things, like tapware. Why are you cranky? Because I did something and I knew it was going to be wrong. So... Babe, I'm not blaming you. No, I know, but we're just wasting everyone's time. Do you want to keep them? No, they suck ass. And I said that when I first got them. But you didn't listen to me. <laughs> They're horrible. Just horrible. I might go in there now and yeah. take back and take the taps back. Yeah. And get different ones. When you work and you have a Saturday morning and you know it's coming up and you know you can sleep in, there's not one day I can sleep until 11. Look at this. I go away for one night and this place is a mess. Isn't it, honey, you naughty little naughty? I'm Enamel full gloss. Is that what you want? No. Hi. Right. What we're looking for is um, 
an enamel, yep. which is plain white, yep. in a sort of a semi-gloss. Yep. Yep. Four litre one. Yep. Four. Four litre? Cool. British paint. It's called a plumber. 1200 flexi gas pipe. Gas flexi. Okay. Two door handles. I need stain. Yeah, 24 hours to go. Jeez. I think we'll be okay. We're not the biggest accessorizers, but we really take it very seriously, just getting the the little accessories right, and we've, you'll see there's a few artefacts in every one of our rooms. We're trying to get that, just an element of raw sort of spirit into each room. So, very conscious of it. Yeah, he's a nice height. 1295. Oh, fantastic. Even That's better. the best bargain that we've had in terms of vases. Well, it I, compares to 3595, it's just, that's... Well, I paid stupidly in a mad frenzy the other day, I paid $55 for a vase, which I can't believe, but $12.95, can't go wrong. I tried the best I could. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what he was thinking. <laughs> it's not completely Andrew's fault. It's, um, he bought them and rang me and said, oh, I've got these, are these gonna be okay? And I just went, yep. And I didn't actually really have a good look at them. I didn't take them out of the box and, and have a good look at them, but he was buying them purely for budget. Ah! Look at this! <laughs> this is so funny. <laughs> the refund excuse is tapware not suitable for winning the block. <laughs> it's true, isn't it? Shocking. Oh, that's so funny. Oh, wow. So it's bitter, right? It's much bitter. They're heaps nice. Yeah. It's just really plain and simple. Oh my gosh, that looks heavy. Back at the block, Matt and Jane's kitchen dining area is starting to take shape. Well, almost. Uh, I never put one of those in before. So, better read the instructions before I make a mistake. Front door seal. I'm not sure about any of this. Hello. Hello. How'd we go? Really good. I got a really good deal. Really good, like like free. No, I spent. But I, they took the other ones back. Oh, did Gary, they? Gary, they took the other ones back. Did they? For how much? Yeah. She's like, don't worry about it. No, for the full price. Yeah, what you pay for them? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to resolve this. <laughs> but we'll try our best. Somehow. This is painful, man. The dishwasher. Painful with a capital P. <gasps> oh my god! How does it not look like it's out of a magazine or something? Look at it. <laughs> quick, quick, quick. Tap, Sorry. Tap, tap. Matt and Trent have abandoned the difficult dishwasher and moved on to the simpler task of installing the glass splashback. Simply slot it in place, right? Pick it up. Right, just make sure you keep it sort of square. Yeah, over that yep. wire? Yep. Yeah. OK. Now, hang on a second. Are you want your hate glass. Are you want your bit of plastic? I'm on my little bit of plastic. Good. Really? OK. Is that tight in there? Yep. Yeah. Really tight. Hey, that a giggy giggy. I'll swap your spots, buddy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, God, I hate glass. It's you just got to be really careful of it, mate. What you got to be doing when you do glass, you got to be looking at the other guy. Because you only need to bend it the wrong way, or the chip, and then it's gone. OK, now. What I want to do, we're going to lay it that way this time. OK? And then we're going to push it up. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, mate. No, 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 no. Drop it. you got to... Matt, you've got to concentrate on this, mate. No, serious, too. Yes, yep, yep. Because if... Because if you do bust it... We're screwed. Well done, boys. Now, just watch the step up there. The brickwork's a bit loose. Lovely. Look at that. 
That's superb, boys. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Signature. Can I give you guys a cold drink? Looks like you need it. What would you like, a solo? Uh, a solo, please. A couple of solos? Cool. Thanks, Alright, now lift it up. Just watch the... He's got to take it out square, mate. Oh. Matt. I'm stuck. And then it's... Matt, don't move it, mate. Alright. Alright, you up over it. Hang on. I'm stuck on this end. Hang on, there you go. Work, hang on, don't bend it, mate. What, is it sitting on the tap? No, it's stuck in the end of the cupboard. Hang, it's, don't you move. It's, oh, hang on, Matt. I didn't move. No, 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 no. Just don't move it, mate. Like, at all. At all. OK? I'm hating this. Let's see. Right. Just spin it over against that wall, mate. Which one? Where the, the wallpaper is. It won't bite you. It will bite me. It'll cut an artery. Well, if it were... Just... I'm more nervous about breaking a piece of glass. Don't worry about that. You'll get a piece of glass tomorrow. If the worst comes, the worst. <sighs> Mate, change your shoes. Be stuck. Oh, man. I was stressing out before because it was, um, you know, 2 o'clock and the, and the spiky still wasn't here. And... Uh, now it's here. So now I feel a lot less stressed out because um, one of the features of the hallway were these blue LED lights that go in the floor. And um, he was ready to leave and I said, oh, can those blue lights operate separately from the, the ceiling lights? And he's like, nah. And I said, well, they need to for tomorrow morning. So he's going to stay and just, it'll take him a few seconds, I think. But nothing takes a few seconds. Everything that should take a few seconds takes at least 20 minutes in this place. And things that should take 20 minutes can take hours in this place. It's just catching. I mean, I wouldn't want to push it that much. <sighs> Fantasy land here. Just, mate, if I've got to move all this, it's going to be just 3 o'clock in the morning. I've got to think about this now. It's really starting to... Well, let's leave it for a minute, mate. Let's do something else. Can you not take those that cupboard out the end one and just lift it up? No, I've got to move this one and that one, because it's still touching there. Is it? Yeah. All right, just pull the f***ing thing and do it again. I'm going to leave it for now and just... No, I've got to do it, mate. Well, I, I can't do this until all this is done, because I don't want anyone walking over. It's just... I tell you what, Today... Now I've got to think about what I'm doing again. All right. I'm not getting anywhere today, Matt. At all. Tempers are flaring again this week, but at least this time it's about the renovation and not about the neighbours. Last week, Jason and Kirsten felt ostracised by the others. Admittedly, they had broken the rules, but then two of the other couples hired a PI to watch over them. It's not mean. It's a game. We're having fun. But what's hilarious to one person may not be hilarious to another. For Jason and Kirsten... I cannot believe these people. A practical joke went a little too far. I can only speculate as to who it may be, but I've got a pretty good idea. Well, she was really looking at me to try and figure out whether I was lying. I'm ready for a bit of biff. All right. Yep, you're all listening. Everyone's focused on getting the rooms ready for tomorrow and keeping to themselves. And hopefully, relationships are on the mend. Thank you. Oh, no worries. Yeah, I think things have really settled down and, you know, we're interacting quite quite well and... Um... We're, we're getting responses to our good mornings and hellos now, which is, which is great. That's a great advance. But you've got to say it's difficult. Oh, incredible. Because you've got to really think about, you know... Oh, look, look I'm not trying... To, the, the, it was one of the most confronting issues I've ever had to deal with. Don't tell me to settle down. You haven't been, the, you haven't been the, at the brunt of this, okay? And to deal with it in this environment just, you know, exacerbates it, 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 it to It did exacerbate it. And if we weren't on the block and that situation had happened, I would have, you know, still been obviously clearly traumatised and just as upset as what I am now. I can't, I can't it, believe it. it. I can't. It, it is the lowest behaviour I've ever, ever encountered. I, I felt myself losing my temper. Um, I've never lost my temper in, in, in the last decade that I can recall. So, you know, for me, that was a new experience over recent times. You've always uh, had control. 
I've always had, con yeah, I've always felt I've had control. So do, that was. Do you, do you Jason guys, is very do, even keeled. Do you, do you guys consider that you might be control freaks? No, not at all. It's gone up a couple more now. Yeah. This might work. Okay. Now that is up. That's up. I'm pretty confident that'll go in. Yeah. All right, mate. Roll it forward. See what happens. Oh, it's touching again. All right, I'll tell you what. Let's hold it there. Do you want Jane just to hold the cupboards up? Just, just put some weight on the... Just you know, Jane, yeah, just sort of hold that there like that. Like that? Yeah. That's in, mate. Yeah. Whoa. Now I know why glaziers are alcoholics. <laughs> well, what a difference one night and a few too many drinks can have on the block. After all the stress of having a room ready for today, last night, our couples decided to blow off a bit of steam and at least attempt to patch up their differences. Good morning. It's a room reveal day on Sunday, and Kirst and I don't want to get out of bed this morning. We both feel hungover, to be honest. Don't feel great. <laughs> never eating pizza again, and I'm never having wine again. We had some drunken lads come down to visit us last night. I think Richard mainly. Barbie and Ken came up here. Hello. I'm just doing my video diary for the night. But I haven't found myself speaking at length with Stephen, or, or more importantly, I think Stephen actually just started speaking to me, so... <laughs> there was a moment when there was only Jason and I sitting here. It was kind of nice to talk to everyone again in a pretty relaxed environment, so that was nice. It was a good night. And it was very amusing. At one stage, we had Richard lying in our bath. That was fun. And Kirsten running around yeah, filming mate. everything. Yeah. Mmm, that's good. <laughs> what happened? Um, <laughs> we're trying to work out. Oh, and do nothing. Anything. What about laying in their bath down there? I was just having some fun. See, I couldn't have been that drunk, Stephen, because I remember everything. I remember lying in their tub. I was just trying to be fun. Look, I need my under eye cream because you're all looking at my baggage. <laughs> Richard was pretty pissed. <laughs> God, he was pissed. Right. He's, he still look pissed. Under eye cream, I really need it. <laughs> I don't have any under eye cream. Yes, you do. You have Clarence, and it's very <coughs> good. I think that's the drunkest I've seen you. Therefore, the drunkest I've seen. Yeah, where's the cream? Uh, <laughs> I know where it is. I was just being polite. <laughs> and that changed pretty quickly. <laughs> I just want to get this room done. I should have done it last night in the peace and quiet. I'm getting caught up in that. So, session. Good. Well, why don't you, you, you go get the flowers? I want to get I'll meet the you back, other I'll meet stuff you back here in, in, um, in okay, well, half an hour. Okay. All done. Just so you're, we've got to be ready at midday. You're getting the flowers? Vacuumed. Mopped. You're getting the flowers? Don't want to be late. You're getting the flowers? Yes. Great. Go. What I'm saying is that even though with what went on last night, they were poking and prodding for information in a roundabout way. And even though you're trying to be nice with them and all that sort of thing and all that sort of thing, just beware. OK. Because I feel they're playing the game, playing war, they're playing the old game. So beware of that. I'm serious too. I think you're right. I what? agree with you and I obey. <laughs> I think you're right. <laughs> bad, bad, bad news. There's nothing. I don't know what to do. Okay. We thought we'd be able to just find a, like a storage unit you know, really easy. I just thought, oh yeah, that'll be easy. But it's not, it's, we can't find. We've found the perfect one and it's from Freedom and it's beautiful, but it's a centimetre too wide. And I've tried to squeeze it and it doesn't work. Right, yeah. Keep coming. Down. Down. 
Oh, the doors are open. Ah, uh, right. Are they, do you want them closed? Hang on. How are you going to get out? Oh, crap, on the top. <sighs> this kitchen comes with trend. <laughs> Hello? You're getting sold with the flat. What does a towering look like with a towering? Yeah, but you could fold it nicely to hang yeah, on it. Yeah, of course. Well, do it. Done. No, let's just get two. Two towerings? We don't have time to pretty it up, you dorkhead. I like towering. Towerings are great. Spot on. Actually, it's funny. It's $300 more. No, it's not. Yeah, 3 2 is what the quote was. Oh, Come on. Seriously? 3 2 was the quote. And you've got 3 5 on here. Alright, I'm gonna have to ring the office, check it up, trace it mm -hmm. up then. Okay. Give it to me. You know, you, you're mucking around, huh? Yeah. I just thought you might be able to change it while you're standing here. No. <laughs> no, mate. It's an office thing. Yeah. No. Get I won't get away with that one. No, you won't. Okay, so what's your date today? 14. 14. 15. 15. Hi, honey. First time I've ever used a router. Hopefully that comes up all right. All right, yeah. hold your breath, people. Hello, sailor. That's pretty good. Look at that. Oh dear. Uh, too high. Yeah, honey, you're out. Oh, nice. Aren't they beautiful? They are, and they're going to look great in there. Yeah. Wow, oh, God. You know we've only got like 45 minutes? I oh, know. I'm bleeding under my nails. Oh, honey. You're in my Wait, space. I know. You're in my personal space. Please. Thank you. What should we do with this, Jace? Just take it away. We've got to have it out. No, we don't. Take we're it. We're revealing it. No, no, we're not. We'll take, take it away, honey. We won't use it. Honey, just take it uh, out now. I don't know why we got it. Oh, my God. What? What's wrong? What are you, what's up? What's upsetting you now, Jamie? It couldn't be any dodgier. What? We're going to get crucified. For what? What is that? What do you mean, what? Have I finished? Do you think it looks OK? Looks great. I just keep moving, honey. Do you think we should have something out on the desk? Honey, just wash the floor. Do you think? No, I think it's nice, clean. Yeah. Oh, God. Just relax. Oh. Andrew? What? What? The ceiling? Tell me it's the ceiling that you're worried about. What, are you worried about the ceiling? How are we going to fix it? Whenever the hell I can get up there and fix it. You're not going to show it, you're dodging it. No, that's it. I'm out of here. I'm done. We're having everyone over for dinner tonight to Chris in the roast. kitchen, and we don't have a stove. I don't know what it is. There's a wire or something. It should be all wired up. But that's just not turning on. It's definitely plugged in and switched on I'll in there. I'll, I'll go off to the switchboard. And just have a look for us. That'd be cool. Hope it doesn't take too long. Is that it? Yeah. Like that? Oh, yeah. Done. Yay! How quick was that? Mango. Find if it's the length is right. Blind is too big. The blind itself. Like the fabric is that size, but all the bits and pieces on it make it too big. It's still got to go on the outside. Oh man, I'm trying to hang blind on the wet window seal because of the bloody reveal has been pushed forward too bloody soon, and now I'm sort of stressing because we're coming to problems. The place is not even clean. <laughs> Wow. 
last minute dodge up and I'm making it even worse. Righto guys, time's up. Come on out. Afternoon, how are you? Aren't we all looking chipper? <laughs> Just another day in paradise. Ah, oh, yes. All looking very pleased with yourselves. Obviously finished on time, ready to go. In fact, the doctor in the house looks like he's been doing a bit of work. <laughs> you look like you're the only one doing hard work all day. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> look at him. Clearly not on my appearance. <laughs> Maybe we should start with you guys. Yeah, why not? Let's I need go. a bar. <laughs> That'd right be good. On. Let's get into it. <laughs> the grand opening. Whoa, look at this. That looks beautiful, guys. Well done. I like the timber top. That's really nice. Have you noticed what that is? That's these floorboards. Oh, is it really? Yeah. yeah. What a great idea. So these are your expensive glass tiles? They yeah. are our feature glass tiles. That looks fantastic with the light coming down there, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. Beautiful. How did you go budget-wise? Got a ballpark figure for me? Nine or ten. OK, that's not bad. For a bathroom, that's not bad at all. Let's do it, Jamie. Let's go. Hey, hey! Ta-da! This is very, very impressive, guys. Thank you very much. Wow. So we've got the his and hers home office. Oh, and the drawers. We hey. had a $1,000 voucher from the Splash range at Freedom, and the Splash is, is traditionally bathroom um, storage. We converted that with our joiner for under, under desk storage. Saved ourselves at least 1000 bucks. Well done. Yeah. It looks expensive. Where are you at with the budget? Just over five thousand dollars for this room. Yeah. Wow, that's not bad. So, are we being a little bit? Maybe six. I can't believe what you packed into six grand. That's amazing. Yeah, we're Thanks. delighted. Ten points. Great. Good on you. So enter. Oh wow, this is fantastic, guys. It's just a prelude. Very nice. God, that's really working well, isn't it, with the light on it? Yeah. Beautiful. And this is our Very room. clever. Oh, that okay. is so impressive. It's great. What is this? Well, it's all touch. Drawers. Oh, wow. All drawers. And that drawers. opens up as well. <laughs> the, yeah, That's yeah. great. So look at all this storage. Yeah. And then, you know, you have a guest come over. Oh, my God. And you have been nice. Bad. <laughs> you guys are full of surprises. <laughs> I love it. Oh, guys, this is incredible. I'm absolutely blown away. I love the way you've changed levels. Yeah. And you've, you've created this fabric backdrop. So it all feels really comfortable and warm. Yeah. Kind of ties in with the front bedroom. Yeah, it does. It ties in with the front bedroom as well. And this is just in, oh, it's so impressive. And how impressive did this is just so beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, it's a beautiful pattern, isn't it's it? It's a great idea. Where'd you get that idea from? Um, I think we just That's made just, it up. Yeah. yeah. This is just such a great table, isn't it? Yeah. It's a beautiful table from Freedom. Yeah. yeah. And an exact yeah. match for the floor too, yeah. which is great. Oh, it's just made for the room, isn't it? Yeah. This yeah. worked hard. Go and get married. Okay. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's on the list of things to do. <laughs> yeah. oh, it is too. Fantastic. Yeah. Well, guys, it's no wonder you were so pleased with yourself. Those rooms were absolutely incredible. Great job. Give yourselves a round of applause. Your attention to detail is sensational once again. Now, I know Matt's got a bit of a dinner party tonight for you all. Chris in the kitchen. But before that, I now declare the block open for inspection. Well done, guys. Get in there and check them out. Oh! Fantastic. They just need a little bit of time touching up. Yeah, but the they'll have it tonight. Right? They'll before do that tonight before it gets judged. And otherwise, I think it's, it's really nice It's going to get really nice beautiful. Plastic flowers. That's tacky. They're plastic. No. Oh, they are. I like the layout. 
I like the hidden toilet. Yeah. Everything's very rounded, mm. isn't it? And we're so square. I think we're the odd ones out. Ah, right. So that all ties in. They've done the bed thing, what uh, we were going to yeah. do. I'm not sure that this style is particularly relevant to Manly, but I certainly think they've got some great ideas in terms of storage. What is that? Oh, they're drawers. Oh, that's great storage. Check out that. Oh my God, it's bright in here. So different from their front room. I'm very impressed with what they've done in here. Completely different style. Completely different style. Oh, wow. <gasps> it's huge. It's like a restaurant. It is, isn't it? Look at the lights. It's a special. Look at the wines. I can't believe they did this in the, the night, time that they considering had. Considering we saw it Thursday night. I know. And there was nothing. There's some functional things. I mean, I, I, if you've got that open, you can't get past. If you've got your oven open, you can't get past. Wow. Look at all that wine. <laughs> Are the curvy lines meant to be like that? I don't think so. They're meant to be straight. They've done well. They'll always do well with any room they do, I know. Oh, wow. That's not even a bedroom. Isn't it? No, I bet that's a, that's a sofa bed. I reckon that's a modified splash. Yeah. Because that's what I said we should do is use it in that. Yeah. Bedroom. Oh, that's really clever. Wow. I didn't expect this. Wow. Look the flowers. I know. They're real. Yeah. Do you like it? I think it's it's a, a good use of an office. It's a nice office. It's yeah. big and open, but uh, there's something there's something about it where I feel like they're losing value in their apartment because this is not a bedroom. Not only that, but this plan of their apartment, there's nothing good in here because they wouldn't be so crazy to leave it here. They wouldn't be so stupid, would they? <laughs> Rate per hour, nothing. Let's just look for the pink cable. I want to know if Richard and Stephen think they may have discovered who their competition is in the secret weapon department of home automation. <gasps> Richard! Sun's up. Well, we knew it would be then. I know. So what are, are they? Mothers. I want to know how much they're paying for it. How long, <laughs> how heavy is the bird? I don't know. Did we get killed? Wasn't there a label on the wrapping? Yeah. That told you the weight? Probably. It just said discounted $6. <laughs> <laughs> Combination grill and microwave. For the first time in six weeks on the block, our couples can sit down and enjoy a home cooked meal together. There's the Panasonic chicken. Toast to the new kitchen, guys. Yeah. Welcome. 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 And to the chef. Enjoy, guys. Love Thank you. you. Thank you so much. Enjoy indeed, because next time on the block, the living conditions are getting down and dirty. Good big. Yeah. How the hell are we meant to sleep in here tonight? Oh. They're working hard Please. to impress the judges. <laughs> oh, my goodness. What is this? As they try to win our biggest prize yet. $10,000. Oh my god. And as the wedding approaches, it seems love is in the air.
Lala. 